Yo, what's up everybody? Welcome to Ghost of Tushishi Legends. Today I'm going to be showing you my samurai build. Show you what I got. I'm not the most... Okay, thank you phone. This is going to be a build about Oni damage and ultimate damage. So as you can see, all my gear is maxed out 110 because I play this game a lot and I have no life. Anyways, I use the water katana because... I mean, come on, water stance is literally the best in the game. Like, who, who, who's going to argue with that? It's literally the best epic katana you can get in the game, my opinion. It's really effective against shieldmen and pretty much everybody else except spearmen. What I have on my water katana is melee damage, 11.4%, and I have oni damage, 9.8%. Also run way of the flame because I feel that that's the best effect on all of katanas because fire damage is just huge in this game and absolutely shreds, in my opinion. And for my range, I use the half bow, which pretty much is way faster than the long bow. If you prefer the long bow, then try and find that versatile effect roll on the long bow. If you prefer long bows over short bows, uh, I personally don't care. The range resolve gain on my short bow is 6%, and I have 7% of headshot damage. Now, this is pretty much basic. You're doing a lot of damage to the head, and two, you're getting a lot of resolve gain. And for my charm, I, I use one legendary. In this build and it's called sacred iron uh enemies that deal damage to me have weak and applied to them so that's actually really good if you're playing with a ronin and then they were to uh debuff enemies around them and weaken them uh this would actually apply and stack up and you do a shit ton of damage and it's actually insane now this is actually a perfect roll and i'm literally not touching this legendary at all I think everything on here is perfect and doesn't need to be changed at all. I have ultimate damage of 20%, which is fucking insane. I have only damage of 10%, uh, which is the max you can get, I believe. Increase the maximum resolve by 1. So I believe I have 4. Actually, I have 5 because one of my techniques. So I actually have 5 resolves on this build, which is actually really good. So it causes me to get my ultimate a lot faster. So that's just a shit ton of damage right there. So if you're taking that only damage plus 10, plus you're taking that 9.8, percent um you're stacking that up to like what about 18 19 percent some shit like that it's a really it's a lot of damage it really is and it's gonna help you out a lot i use dirt throw i literally cannot switch off a of dirt throw look at all these katanas i'm never gonna use them all right so moving over to my smoke bomb it's uh, 120 seconds uh for a cooldown and, you know obviously it creates a smoked location in your area and plus you get to do stealth kills um, I have a stealth attack damage and cooldown reduction of 8.9% uh, was actually pretty good. Uh, so obviously it lowers the cooldown, cooldowns. It lowers your cooldowns and you do good stealth attack damage from behind. Also, I have sudden resolve, which fills the first resolve on you. So that's giving my resolve back every time I use the smoke bomb. So that's really good. So overall, it's just a pretty solid samurai build. So moving over to the techniques for my samurai, what do we got? Obviously the Hachiman Fruity. Um... I use the, what is it called, Spirit Pool, which pretty much uh, sucks people in, it sucks people off, you turn into Shang Tsung and you steal their life, I mean, why would, I mean, why wouldn't you use that, it's literally free, it's free HP, so you don't really have to worry about HP as a samurai, plus you're super tanky as fuck, so it doesn't even matter, anyways, uh, I use uh, increased melee damage by 10%, so that's really good for my build overall with the damage on top of that. And increase max resolve by one, so that gives me the five with my other item on my uh, build, on my on my charm. My legendary charm is giving me resolve, plus this effects on my techniques is giving me resolve, so that's five resolves in total. I use the Hachiman Fury, the two extra strikes, because I feel that like with three, it's just underwhelming, and honestly, I, I just want to finish off my target. It's up to you, whatever you want to use. Um, if you want to use uh, an unblockable quick strike for one resolve or increase the number of legendary items you can have by one. I personally don't care about that stuff. Uh, I'm cool with just one legendary. Sometimes the uh, your techniques, one of them is just worth that than another legendary. Unless you're trying to do another type of build and, you know, stuff like that. So that's pretty much my build. And obviously I use this mask, the fox mask, because I'm a fat samurai fox. And then I use the Come on, crew, I red. I use that helmet and I use the Defender Black. And my sword kit, I use the, the moon bear's paw. And uh, fuck, this game is goddamn addicting. I'm going to go play some more. <laughs> Alright, see ya.